Some consumer groups are now calling on the DMV to reclassify Tesla's autopilot driving feature. This comes after a Tesla on autopilot crashed into a police car in Orange County. And as Mark Mester reports, that's not the only crash that has some people saying that they fear this feature is dangerous. How many people have to die before we relabel a function that doesn't do what it says it's supposed to do? How many people have to die in Tesla on autopilot when everybody recognizes it's not autopilot for the DMV to act. You were just listening to one of two members who were at today's news conference. We had members of the Center for Auto Safety and also a group called Consumer Watchdog. Essentially what they did was they called on members of the DMV to investigate what they call deceptive Tesla autopilot marketing. And they also charged that statements violate new autonomous vehicle regulations. Of course, Tesla has been in the news a lot recently for a long laundry list of problems involving crashes with their vehicles, but specifically for the vehicles that are using the autopilot function. And we had one yesterday in Orange County, as I mentioned at the top of the hit. We have the video for you as well. You'll notice that dark colored Tesla, it slammed right into a parked police cruiser with the Laguna Beach Police Department. This happened about 11 o'clock yesterday morning, Laguna Canyon Road, the 20,600 block. And if that address sounds familiar, it's because it is. A year ago, from the month of April, there was another crash in that exact same area, a Tesla slamming right into a parked semi truck. That vehicle was also using the autopilot function. So officials have to go through the process of figuring out whether or not it was topography, whether or not it was a GPS system malfunction, or perhaps the way the stripes are painted on the road. Tesla has issued a statement. I read the following. Tesla has always been clear that autopilot doesn't make the car impervious to all accidents. And before a driver can use autopilot, they must accept a dialogue box, which states that autopilot is designed for use on highways that have a center divider and also clear markings.